Hey, what's up everyone? This is Dom and today I'm going to show you a new Cydia tweak called Dash. Dash is a brand new app switcher for iOS and it's uh, got a pretty cool look to it. It adds some flair to the default app switcher on iOS. It actually completely replaces it. So let's go ahead and check out the default feature of Dash. If we double tap the home button, which is how I have it set up, you can actually set it up however you'd like uh, with different activator commands. If you double tap it, you'll see that Dash pulls up and we have the ability to kind of swipe through little screenshots of the app. So it's pretty neat. In order to close an app, all you have to do is swipe up on that app. It's pretty simple actually, and we can close it with this button in the corner here, or you can just press the home button again. But Dash also has a bunch of other settings available to it. So let's go ahead and check out some of the settings here. We have the activator settings, which we can set a different activator command. Like you see, we can set different activator methods for the home button, for the lock screen, so on and so on. And there's also different animations here. So if we go into the animation settings, right here we have five different animation options. And hopefully they'll be adding more here in the future. But these are a good start right here. So let's check it out. We just had scroll, which is this one right here. Just kind of scroll across. Then we have cover flow. Let's change it to cover flow. And cover flow, you see we have this smooth cover flow style <laughs> switcher exactly what it sounds like. Next we have Time Machine and the ones with the star next to them aren't going to be as smooth on older devices. I'm using a 4S though and this is pretty smooth here and I think they did a really good job with the animation. And as you can see it kind of works like Time Machine would as you swipe back and forth here. This one I find a little more difficult to use but it still looks pretty sweet. Let's check out Rotary. This is Rotary. And here on Rotary, you see they just kind of rotate in a circle like that. And I like how all the detail put into it, you can see the other ones flowing behind it. So I think that's really special and it's really cool. Then we have my favorite, which is the one at the bottom right here. It's called Cylinder. This is a, it's pretty smooth animation here. So let's check this out. So we have Cylinder and exactly what you think it would do. It does a cylinder effect to the apps. It kind of makes them rotate in a circle like that. And again, the detail put into this is amazing. As you can see, like you can see the weather back there. It's backwards actually until we go to it right here and then it's forwards. And yes, it is really 102 here. This is a pretty smooth looking tweak and I really enjoy it. It's definitely going to be one of my default app switchers from now on. And also Dash is available now in Cydia under the Mod My Eye repo for $1.99. It comes from SB Coders. Like it says in here, those animations that are marked with the star are more memory intensive. They're recommended that you use them with newer devices like the new iPad or the iPhone 4S or even the new iPhone when it comes out. So I hope you enjoyed Dash. I really think it's a, a pretty cool Cydia Tweak app switcher and it's available now. I, I think it's great and they did a great job. Thank you very much for watching. This has been another episode of Jailbreak Advice. I'm Dom and have a great day. <laughs>